Indeed, right oh here. Oh god, we're in. We're in. Um. Oh god, I have to. I have to find um eight cameras before this thing kills me. Ugh. I think I got it. It's not like the paparazzi was coming after Montezuma, just some careless tourists. Anyway, no more burritos for me for a while, huh? The good news is we've completed the first quest. Now, let's go inside and see what part of King Arthur's armor we've recovered. First... Behold, you have proven your word and recovered an exceptional part of King Arthur's armor. This is his battle helm, which shielded him from certain death in epic combat. Turn this helmet back to me at the round table, and I shall reveal the next clue to the greater purpose of your journey. An even greater challenge awaits, with yet an even greater reward. You have returned to King Arthur's helmet, passing the first of many tests. Now I will reveal the next clue to the greater purpose of your quest. Recovering all of Arthur's armor is only part of what will be needed to complete your journey. Possession, and only with that can the ultimate destiny be fulfilled. Behold, it is Excalibur, the mystic blade of the king. But the sword can only be wielded by someone from the bloodline of kings. Hey, I shall not reveal any more of this bloodline unless you can solve the next quest. But know ye this, there is too much at stake, and if the sword fell into the wrong hands, it would spell the doom. Why? You just said no one but the un person with the blood of the king can wield it. Like, how how would that be dangerous? Maybe when the full moon is almost upon us, quest he once again to the circle of stones and await the lunar rays of the night. Hey, I think I saw this moon before. Shh, just wait. Poseidon was the Greek god of the sea who guarded the lost city of Atlantis. He bore a powerful trident encrusted with Atlantean energy crystals. We'll need to find the crystals and return them to the trident. That's the only way to enter the lost city of Atlantis. Sounds like more traveling. And this time, seafood is on the menu. Hey, I wonder if Poseidon liked cocktail sauce with his shrimp. Bon voyage and bon appétit. Merlin has sent us on our second quest, this time to recover the Atlantean crystals. Captain Melville, an old salty fisherman, is willing to give us an Atlantean crystal, but he was driven mad by the sea and can't remember where he hid it. But at least he remembers hiding it inside something from his garage or workroom. He's given us a list of potential items it might be hidden in. Oh god, which room should we start with? Uh... The scary one or the indoor one? Scary one. Oh god. Flashlight, paintbrush, axe, goggles, miner lantern, plumber's wrench, compass, torch, watering can, scissors. Hmm. No? Watering can? <sighs> well, I do have a quick question about, like, Poseidon, how can he be guarding the lost city of Atlantis if it is supposedly lost? He's the only one that knows. Indi oh, there we go. Uh, uh, paper. I think I see the axe. It's like to the left. It's like on the left. Yeah, there we go. A plumber's wrench just has me confused. Unless it's like the weird red thing that looks like a P. Yep, there we go. <laughs> I saw it just as you were saying about it. <laughs> so you are blind then. No, I'm sorry. Goggles? That can mean like anything. Well, it's definitely not the pair of glasses on the workbench. Oh, I see them. Um, uh... Shelf near the window. Okay, skizzers, paintbrush, and torch. Skizzers? 
How dare you pronounce scissors wrong? No. Scissors, paintbrush, and torch. Like, one of the rules like that my parents told me was like never run with scissors. Yep. Well, like, sorry, mom, but like I've run with scissors before, and like, no, wait, I probably shouldn't. Your mom is not gonna watch this. Yeah, but no like, one's gonna watch this. Yeah, yeah. Well, like, probably not. Like, no one though. But well, okay, fine, fine. You yes. might watch this. Hey. Well, true. Yes. Okay, fine. Fine then. I have run with scissors before, and like nothing has happened. It's in case Although, you trip and land on them, buddy. I will not trip over a tree root tomorrow at 10 a.m. with scissors in my hand. Dialing the police right now. It was nice knowing you. Thank you. We, we need to find these, though. Paintbrush, torch, and scissors. Yeah, uh... Let me see. Let me see. All these... Oh, it's like tape or something. Like that orange glowing thing that like, doesn't even resemble anything. Like in the window. I don't think it's supposed to. Yeah, okay. I think uh, it might just be tape across the window. Yeah, that's what I think. Uh... Well, thought, rather. God, I wish I had, like, painted more. <laughs> painted more? Yes. Because I can't... Found the scissors. Well, I barely remember, like, what a paintbrush looks like. Yes. Really? So, yeah. It's just a yeah. stick with bristles on the end. Well, I'm sorry though, but we were supposed to paint like my um um our like deck like a few years back. And we did, but like then we started on the railing, didn't finish that, wanted to get the railing done next year. Next year came along and we did nothing on the railing. Like completely nothing. Okay, paintbrush or torch? Torch or paintbrush? Well, I would if I could find them. Fine then. Uh. Here, torchy, torchy. Come to Papa. No. Weren't you the one just telling me that that doesn't work? Why do you always have to cure my logic with your logic? Because my logic is apparently superior. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I do not know why I found that funny as fuck, but I did. If my logic manages to kill your logic, it means your logic is flawed. But I like my logic. Still doesn't make it good. It still makes it flawed. So? It's not like it really matters in like the long run scheme of things or some shit. Torch. Paintbrush. Paintbrush. Torch. I can't see them anywhere. Um, left hand corner, like right below the map. Nope. Okay. They're blueprints. Both, they're both just sticks. That's not a map. That's blueprints. Jeez. <laughs> both the torch and the and paintbrush. Are just sticks. The torch just has cloth wrapped around the top, and the paintbrush just has bristles on the top. Yes. So, why is this so hard to find two sticks? Well, I found a magnifying glass. Yeah, I've seen that like 13 times now. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> and. One plus 13 is 14, so now you've seen it 14 times. Paintbrush, torch. <laughs> Why is this impossible? Tick tock. No, like seriously, where the fuck are we looking for this? 
Okay, like this. I don't see anything on the desk. Me either. Hmm. There's not a lot of places that I haven't really looked, which means I must have seen it like 13 times by now, but I just haven't found it. Every time I seem to doubt myself, I find it. Like, I'm never going to find this torch, man. I've looked, like, everywhere for it. How come I cannot find this torch? It's so... It's just a bloody piece of cloth on a stick. That, it didn't work. Wait, so... Wait, so... It's a bloody piece of cloth on a stick. Yep, find so, it. So, like, blood, who's blood, burns. blood zombie? Blood burns. Hmm. Okay. Torch. Wherefore art thou, Torchy Torch? <sighs> that was the torch? Oh my god. I give up. Carpenter's belt, human skull, bobblehead, rawhide, drill bits... Dropper, brain crystals, cheese, open ended wrench. Brain crystals. That sounds like a nice way to go. Found crystals. You know, we found a brain in like the, in like one of the other ones. I forget which one, but yeah, we found a brain. So we yeah, can't... it's like, like, why can't we just use that one? Like, seriously. What the hell is a carpenter's belt? A belt, duh. Found it. I see, I told you. Uh... Could the raw hide like be like that like you looking thing below like the the fan looking Nope. No. Okay. What's a dropper? Like an eyedropper, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I found the bobblehead. Too much clicking. You need to tone it down. I'm not always clicking when I move the mouse. Yeah, 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 yeah. You would think, just... you would think cheese would be a lot easier to find. Yeah. I'm guessing it's probably like in those potatoes, but I don't really know. No, I clicked this already. Okay. Uh, could it be by the glove? Could it seriously be by the glove? This one or this one? That one. Where? Uh, the the the, uh, the yellow rubber, square thing. This rubber chicken? No. Um. I think that's glove, I, th yellow I think that's part of the box. Okay, damn it. I haven't clicked it yet, but I think it's part of the box. It has fucking holes in it, too. So, like, so like I'm, like, seriously guessing cheese, but... I, I, really I think that cheese would be a bit easier to spot. It's not hidden behind the bone next to the spider, is it? Nope. Okay. I honestly don't have any clue what a dropper is. <sighs> Me neither. Well, I have used, like, my eardropper, but that was before, so. Try, um, I tried clicking all these things that look like they drop oil on stuff, but mm. none of them worked. Maybe try Googling dropper. Uh, fine. Just find a quick image of it so you know what it looks like. Yeah. Um, oh yeah, escape button, dingus. <laughs> what am I still looking for? Drill bits, rawhide, cheese, and dropper. I was not expecting cheese to be the one that stumped me. Yeah, it's um. So okay, ah, oh, jeez. Luckily, I have used one of these before. I used it to get gas out of my um lawnmower. So you know what it looks like? 
Yeah. Yeah. Well, maybe it was oil. I don't know. I forget which one, but... Okay, so then you're going to look for the dropper, and I'm going to look for the other three. Hey, a Coca-Cola can. <laughs> what? Oh, cola. It's not Coca-Cola, yeah. it's just cola. Oh, oh yeah, cola. Bleh. <laughs> and I'm also trying to figure out what the rawhide is. No, Brain, the dropper is not the fucking thermometer. And drill bits, where the hell would you find those? Like, is there just a bundle of drill bits somewhere? Or is there just one drill bit and I have to find like seven of them? Is it on top of the toolbox? Where? Uh... Oh, uh, that's a, uh, uh, to the left, right next to, like, the ladybug thing? That's no, the, right? That's to the right, right, and those are coins. Oh, oops. I clicked them just in case, but no, those are definitely coins. Okay. What exactly does this dropper look like? Because I'm gonna keep my eye open for it, too. Found the cheese! Oh. That's wrong for my guess. Uh, damn, I don't know how to describe things. I really fucking don't. I'm like the worst at like explaining shit. Like seriously. Do your best. Uh, I can't, dude. It's not forming into words. Oh wait, no, go back up. Uh, to the right. Yeah, that thing, maybe? That's a candle. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I found the rawhide. Nice. By accident. The, ma the mouse froze, and I didn't mean to click on that, but I got it. <laughs> nice. I want to say it's a thermometer thing, but I know it's not. And I've already clicked on the thermometer. I know. I know. It, it's making me so angry. So it looks like this, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, uh, it's, um, it is, is related to that, but it's more, um, it is more in, like, thickness related to the candle. So it's short and thick rather than long and thin. Yeah. Nope, that's not it. You know, the worst is, though, like, when I see something, I have to click it twice to make sure that it registered to click. <laughs> oh, yeah. So I get Merlin popping up a little too much. A dropper and drill bits. Oh. This is going to drive me nuts. Well, at least you're not a squirrel. That makes no sense. Squirrels go nuts for nuts. They also like seeds. Oh, yeah. What is a dropper? <sighs> Okay. I yawned. I'm back in it. What is this thing over here? Nothing, apparently. Oh my god, drill bits. How could something so tiny be so hard to find? How could something so big be so hard to find? Well, I would think that they would make the tiniest thing, like the drill bits, like super big. Mm. Mm. Hint time? Hints you mean. What the fuck is a dropper? And where the fuck are the drill bits? I honestly have no idea what a dropper is.
God, yeah, dude. Jesus, like, I'm like no help at all, dude. Like, where are you, you stupid shits? I thought maybe that yellow thing was something. Yeah, it kind of looks like something. I'm just kind of lost at the moment now. I don't know what to look for. I'm looking. Oh my gosh. Holy shit, what is this? Forged in God's very flames. Do mine eyes tell me lies? I can't find a drill a bit. Or lames. I oh, don't know, I got lost. Yeah, uh... What is a dropper? What is a dropper? Go to the right... Uh, oh, well, that sucks. I was gonna... I was gonna Google dropper. But... My recording probably picked up that internet page. Yeah... I got two items left and two hints, which will show me exactly where those two items are. I'm thinking but, like this. But you want to go through this game without using hints. Well, try to challenge yourself, man. I'm trying to, but neither of us can find what this is, and I don't even know what one of them is. Then, like, have your American friend do it. But you can't find it. <laughs> oh, yeah, shit. Um, okay. Uh, take you arrow, go up like uh, that's way too fucking far. Um, okay, uh, down like two inches. Uh, another inch. Uh, go to the right to the the thermometer, and then go like another inch and a half. Uh, subtract a half. Um, there's like plier things like what's like that little needle thing right there yeah that thing nothing apparently damn it I thought I yeah not fucking stumped shit uh oh what? what that was a bottle that was a bottle that was a fucking bottle dude it was massive that's that's okay. fucking bottle. There's no way to fucking drop it. Drill bits better be fucking the ends that you put in the fucking drill. Otherwise, I'm gonna be kind of pissed because that's what I've been looking for. It's the black glove. No. Oh my god! If it was, I'd kill somebody. <laughs> like flip a lid or some shit. Just like fucking go Hulk or something. I don't know. Um. God, where's the drill bits? Is this it right here? Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, shut up. See you all later.